Good evening. Hello. How are you all doing? I'm not being so frequent with my lives recently, but I've decided to pop in today and tell you more about my dating detox program plus all the possible tips about the dating detox and how it can benefit your life as a single person and help you find true love. Let me just quickly share this live in my group. By the way, the group is for single women who are ready to step up, who are ready to do... Hello Grace, how are you doing? Who are ready to step up in love and who are ready to do some work around self-love, self-worth and uh, then from a happy place, from a place of worth, attract the love of their lives. And okay, and the group is called Get Ready for Love with Ashka Colton. And here it is. Go to my group. So hi Grace, lovely to have you here. So just for for the people who don't know me, sorry, I have to find a nice position. The the light is quite crap because my lamp has gone off and I haven't charged it. So never mind. Uh, for the ones who don't know me, I'm Ashka Colton, the dating de detox specialist, and I work with single ladies who are absolutely frustrated with dating and who are struggling to find the right kind of man. And I take them on a dating detox. And during the detox, they uh, learn how to love and value themselves. And as a result, they stop making the same mistakes in love and they start making more empowered romantic choices and they attract high quality guys and true love to their life. And I do what I do because I have gone through this myself. I used to be a woman with no self-esteem, with no self-worth. I didn't believe a happy and healthy relationship was for me. I didn't feel like I was good enough to actually manifest a man who was um, who would love me for who I was. I didn't believe in myself. So many different issues. Uh, most of all, I was absolutely desperate for a relationship. That's why I dated for 10 years before I found him. And I managed to go on 110 online dates. I mean, with the guys from the internet. And there were lots of love attempts and short-lived relationships. On many occasions, I got my heart broken and I had to mend it. And in the process, I lost faith in love, faith in men. And I decided that I was going on a dating detox. And that was the best decision of my life. Because this time I spent on my own helped me focus on myself and find myself and define to myself who I was and what I wanted to attract and do work around self-love and start to believe that I can have an amazing relationship and step into my power. And from this place, I decided I wasn't going to settle for anything less than my amazing man and my amazing relationship because I found my bliss. I became a happy single woman. I didn't want to give that up just for anybody. It had to be an extraordinary man. And when I decided to stop the dating detox after two years, and by the way, I was on a dating detox for two years only because I really, really loved it. I really enjoyed my life. I really enjoyed my own company. I didn't have any issues with that. I worked through all the shit I believed previously. And I was in a very, very happy space. But then after two years, I thought, you know, I've been living like a nun. Maybe it's time to go on a few dates and have fun with some guys. Jesus, the light is really horrible here. So I did. And I went on a few dates. And uh, they were all with amazing guys. High quality guys, as I call them. And very quickly, I met the love of my life. And we've been together for three years. We already have a boy together. And this is my story. And my story is an, an inspiration for you. If you are in the same situation as me, if you are a frustrated single lady who keeps dating anybody and keeps getting disappointed and 
keeps getting frustrated because let's be honest online dating can be a minefield and you have to be fit for it you have to be uh, strong and confident and assertive and have strong boundaries around it so you don't get ahead and you don't waste your time for the wrong kind of guys and I'm being really conscious of this light because it's really it's really not nice I can see myself on the computer and I'm really blurred so time to buy better lights and I can help you basically I can take you on the same journey I took myself I, I can help you with my tools I have tested on myself and my clients and get you to a space from which manifesting an amazing guy would will be effortless and much easier but I know some women, some single women will be listening to me and they will be probably thinking, no, I just need more dating. You know, I just need dating tips and I need to learn how to, uh, learn how to flirt, how to be more attractive, how to seduce. And, you know, I was there as well. I read any, any book on the subject and uh, I went for courses. I did courses online. I had like about 50 different versions of my uh, dating, online dating profile. So I did lots of work to find a man, the kind of work which I called the safest work. Like if you are having problems with dating, you think your issue is with dating, where I believe your issue is with your energy. You have to show up differently. You have to, you have internal or inner blocks which are preventing you from meeting the right kind of guys and attracting the right kind of guys. So I take the ladies who work with me one step back. So we put the dating aside. Obviously, it's a dating detox. So we stop the dating for a while. You know, the man can wait and the relationship can wait. When you get fit and you are in a better space yourself, you will be able to attract completely different guys because this happened to me and it happens to my clients. So we take a step back and we help you reconnect with yourself and find the sense of self and the wholeness you already have within. Um, when you stop thinking that, you know, you need a man to complete you, you need a man to keep you happy or make you happy, that your life will be much better if you have someone. And yes, on occasion, it will be much better, but on some other occasions, it will be more challenging. You know, relationships are not easy. And if you believe a fairy tale, I advise you to stop it because there are no fairy tales. Relationships take work. And the more work you do as a single, the easier your life will be with the right partner. There'll be less work to do because you will be a better version of yourself. And you will attract someone who is more compatible with you. So there will be less work and more kind of uh, pleasure, joy and happiness between you two. And I can tell you that the relationship I'm in now, even though we have more challenges because we have a little baby, we have two businesses, we don't have like uh, extra support with our child. So we have to swap and stuff. And... Uh, I believe we have more challenges than I used to have in my previous relationships. I feel like we don't have as much work to do uh, currently because we communicate, we are honest, we are kind of open and uh, we have both boundaries. We both have our individual little worlds. We are not kind of spending like 24 hours together and we are comfortable with each other. Well, in my previous relationships, we didn't have much uh, to really overcome if I look back and not many challenges in terms of, you know, kids, uh, not having enough money and all these big things which can really happen in a long-term relationship. But it felt like I had to constantly work on those relationships because we were so incompatible. And, because, and I don't blame my exes. I blame myself for my choices. And actually, I don't blame myself because I needed them. I needed to be in those relationships to uh, learn who I needed to become to attract my amazing guy and my happy and healthy relationship. So all is well. I don't uh, hold any grudges. It was meant to be. I needed all the lessons I've been through. Um, the point is like if you believe you need more dating tips you can go to a dating coach and work with a dating coach and you can learn all the possible dating um, dating tips and um, 
get all the possible dating suggestions and you can apply them all like I did and you still won't find the right kind of guy because there is the inner work which needs to be done. And my dating detox is all about the inner work. The dating is the, the cherry on top of the cake. The dating can be only addressed if you feel happy, if you have an amazing and strong relationship with yourself, if you love yourself unconditionally, if you know your value, and so and so forth and your self-esteem is on a healthy level if you know how to read uh, the red flags if you have very strong and healthy boundaries then you are ready to learn how to date and what to do but by then if you believe in yourself and if you love yourself you will need many dating tips because you will be brave to show up authentically and un unapologetically in dating and you'll be yourself and you'll be creating completely different experiences and attracting completely different guys. So this is my solution to your dating frustration. Stop it. If you are frustrated, stop it because you won't get any anywhere with it. You won't be meeting the right guys because you'll be sending the negative energy out there. You probably are bitter with men. You're probably losing faith in love. You're probably doubting your man even exists. You probably feel that there is something wrong with you. So if you are that kind of woman and you have all sorts of thoughts like that, you need to stop dating and give yourself a little break. It doesn't have to be two years. It was my choice because I really loved it. But even a few weeks, even a few months will give you the space to address the issues you need to address and to help you work through the inner stuff which is blocking you from attracting the right kind of guy and having a blast dating and, and finding true love. So if you are that kind of woman and if you're feeling frustrated and if you feel like enough is enough and i really deserve the best possible man and i want to do whatever it takes to find him and attract him i want to invite you to my dating detox experiment it's a 14 day uh, group program we will have a separate facebook group for for the support and for the sisterhood and for all the daily lessons i'll be uh, posting there there will be regular lives as we need them so you can ask your questions and get my support and get my coaching and i will be basically sharing everything with you what i have learned myself on my journey to finding true love there will be exercises, there, uh, there will be my support, uh, an ongoing support. I will be in the group every single day and I will be posting different prompts and journaling prompts. There will be lots of journaling to do, so you might as well get yourself a notebook. And we will have an amazing time. I know it's going to be epic because my energy is so high. I keep creating the content and I keep adding the lessons. And there's already more than I need to cover in 14 days. So maybe there will be a surprise towards the end and I'll add some more bonuses to it. Whatever uh, I decide on the spur of the moment. But the deal is pretty good because I decided to make it a low end investment. It's only £97 for the two weeks. There's another VIP option with a, um individual session with me towards the end so we can wrap it up and help you step into the energy of the high quality woman who effortlessly attracts the love of her life. And I would love you to join me. If you feel like this is the time to do some work, this is the perfect time and the perfect program for you. And if you have any questions, please feel free to PM me. I will be more than happy to uh, tell you more about it. We'll cover what I've just discussed it. We discussed here. Uh, first, your personal happiness and how to take responsibility for it and how to make sure you are in a happy place before you go out there and start attracting the uh, high quality guys. Uh, we will address your relationship with yourself and how you can improve it, how you can deepen it and how you can uh, reconnect with yourself on a deeper level. So you have the security from within and you show up uh, confidently and authentically in dating. Then obviously self-love is a big thing, self-worth is a big thing, so there'll be modules on that. And then we'll progress into setting up healthy boundaries and getting more clarity on who you want to attract and who you need to be to attract that person. 
And if you have more questions, come back to me. I'll be more than happy to uh, give you more info and get to know you and connect. And if you have any questions, uh, please post them below. I'll come back to the live stream later on to answer them. Thank you very much to everyone who is on for joining me. And I hope you've taken something uh, from this live stream for yourself. Keep well, everybody, and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye-bye.